I worked with a girl for a while. Actually, it was a while ago, for about two years. And she was going really good. And then one day, she just went out. And when she finally did come back, she looked terrible. She had lost about 10 pounds. She'd lost some of her teeth. She looked like shit. And um, it was like, like she'd lost her soul or something. Anyway, after that, she couldn't stay in the program for more than three or four days at a time. And she disappeared for about two, about two weeks. And then Charlie calls me one day and he says that uh, Denise blew her fucking brains out with a shotgun. They didn't find her body for almost a week. And when they did, she was so bloated that her stomach had burst. And I don't know, I, I thought about it for a while and I, and I realized that that could have been me. And I didn't want to be like Denise. Fuck, it's... If I don't stay clean, then that's what's gonna happen to me. And if it weren't for Denise, I might not fucking be here right now. She, she saved my life. So I just want to tell you that you never, ever have to be alone again. And keep coming back. Thank you. Fuck this. Come on, I need a shot. Can you just wait until after the break? I can't, I'm gonna die. Just try. <sighs> just try. Thanks, Ginger. Say. What's going on? Are you all right? How much more money do you have? Mm. I don't know, like 10 or 13 bucks. Why? Please. No, okay, I come on, just wait till after the meeting. It's almost over. I can't wait that long. Come on, in an hour I go cold turkey. She's fucked. All right. Oh, shit. That's all I have, right? Thanks. Listen to me, listen to me. Don't go downtown, okay? See if Nigel has anything first. You too, okay? Don't go downtown, all right? Do you have any more money? How much do you have? 20. I don't know. I only have like $8 left. That's okay. Careful, save me some. Thanks, Chrissy. I waited out front for you here. Eight. Hello. 